happy Saturday. It's Saturday and guess who's off today? <laughs> you guys don't understand how exciting that is. Um, And no, it's not so much that I'm off today because I've been off on the weekends, but I usually take a trip. And this weekend I said I was going to stay. Um, oh, snap. Good morning. Welcome back to another vlog. Um, I clearly look crazy. Um, it's actually freaking 10 42 in the morning your girl <laughs> would not get up for the life of her this morning so i put my alarm for eight o'clock i naturally woke up at 7 50 and i was like perfect and then the eight o'clock alarm i actually like went back to sleep my eight o'clock alarm went off and i snoozed and i snoozed and i snoozed next thing i knew it was 10 45 i mean 9 45 and then i woke up I got on my computer, I fixed my bed, and then when the kitchen was clear, I made my coffee, I made some waffles, and here we are. But I wanted to say good morning, I wanted to intro the vlog and stuff, but we have a fun day ahead of us. So it's going to be me and my sister, Jessia, it ran to the store really quick because she's working on an order for a customer. If you guys don't know, my sister has a small business and she's doing a graduation cap. And um, yeah, so what else was I going to do? Oh, I was going to say oh i want to go get a pedicure and so i was like i might as well get that done now so that being said we have to get up and go get ready and obviously my hair looks type crazy because my hair was in a bun yesterday and it was snatched like my hair was snatched to capacity to the point where it gave me a headache but i can't sleep like that because if not i'll be tortured <laughs> so it's in a clip right now and yeah so we're gonna go get ready and hopefully go because it's the week of thanksgiving that's a fun one so it is the week of thanksgiving so i can only imagine what traffic is going to be like this week in the grocery stores and in the nail salon because everyone's probably doing the same thing i already did my nails last week but my toenails need to be done and it's not going to my toenails i'm not going to lie to you because my toenails if i really wanted to i could hack it <laughs> Because no one's really looking at it. Because I do gel, so it's not like they're chipping or anything. They're just grown out a little bit. Um, My shoulder just cracked out. I wonder if you guys heard that. And um, also, I just really want the foot massage. Your girl's feet are crying almost every single day now. I'm so happy. I did get to sleep in. My body needed it. So it's totally fine. But that just means we got to time crunch the rest of the day. Anyway. Let me go get ready and I'll see you guys in the car. Y'all, we're finally on the move. Okay, for reference, it is 11.45 now. It's been an hour since I talked to you. That's embarrassing. I've got Tessio with me. But anyways, okay, so it took me forever because I wanted to actually get ready. I didn't feel like just throwing myself together. Like I did? Yeah, I didn't feel like doing that. I wanted to actually get ready and whatever. I have perfume and everything on on a Saturday. Sit to the right, and you'll see the, the free vacuums. We got towels and everything there. Oh, so. awesome! Thank you. Okay, and there's blow dryers that have blow out the windows because it's a new car. You want to blow it out. You don't want to put too much towel on the up. machine, or do I do that over there over manually? There. Over there. All right. Thank you okay. so much. For you uh, mirrors in if they really want to matter. Thank. Uh, they're not. Oh wait, are they? Okay, I'll take them. I'll do it. Don't worry about it. I don't know anything about this car. Cause I've never. That's the button there, but I don't know. Where is it? At least he was ballsy enough to do it. Thank you. <laughs> wow. Oh my god, I'm scared. How do I drive into this thing? Oh no. Oh hell no. Hold up. Wait, wait, wait. Pause. Pause. They'll help you. Pause. I'm pretty sure there's a lot of people who don't know how to do it. I know. So basically, it's called Paradise Car Wash, and you basically pay for it up front. So you, there's different levels. I got the one where like you go through the machine and then you vacuum it out here, because I was like, whatever, and it was $25. But if you pay for more, they'll like detail it for you. 
I just didn't want them to detail my car because my car's still new. I didn't want another smell in there. So, no biggie. Huh? Yeah. But yeah. So it was fun. And now my baby's all clean. Look at her. She's so cute. Okay, let's go. Okay, my baby's all clean. Wow, it's so clean. What, my, my car thing? Yeah. The lock? Excuse me. Let's see if they have an Instagram. Paradise. Okay. Paradise car wash. So that was fun. Okay, so this is Paradise Car Wash in Port St. Lucie. Oh, in Port St. Lucie, Florida. I mean, they have to have some kind of social media because there's literally a hologram that comes up on your thing. They're brand new too. So like they just opened up like the beginning of the month. Yeah. So we were gonna go do our nails. But things are a little more important right now. I'll wait till my toes next week, I guess. But let's go to Target. Guys, look how cute these little moccasins are. I used to wear moccasins. Listen, that is cute. I used to use and abuse moccasins in high school. I used to wear it to school every day. I had, your girl had a really bad case of senioritis. And there came a point where I was wearing like, my like senior sweatsuit and moccasins every day to yeah, school. <laughs> so that was like my own personal uniform. And at one point we weren't even allowed to wear moccasins anymore, right? I wore them at until least, they were literally ripping off. But. Of like well, my class anyway. I think there was a point where they were like, you guys can't wear I mean, seniors still wore them because they didn't really tell us anything. But that was my uniform. But look what I just found. Target is on it, right? Look at these. Y'all tell me these don't look like the Steve Madden ones. Like identical. They did a really good job. And how much are these? These are $39.99. The Steve Madden ones are like $125. If not, maybe $250, I think. It's like, they have like, um, they have like slippers that kind of look like the Ugg ones. Mm -hmm. The Ugg ones are like $120 and those are $40. Bucks. It makes me wonder though, because I know obviously you're paying for quality, but like. Yeah, 100% I would buy. I'm sorry, I'm just happy with this. I would buy the 121. I, me too. I am a thousand like percent the type of person to buy the name mm -hmm. brand. Because also, I want to keep the brand around. You know what I mean? Like. Yeah. I want a white tree. Well, I don't mind. Even if that one looks prettier. I don't want those big ones, man. I'm just like. I want I'm, a black tree, kind I'm of. I'm very much like go big or go home type of girl. Like. I know. This is. Doesn't make sense. You're funny because I'm the same way, but in a different way. It For example, that's why my room is not cheaper. done yet because I want everything all at once. You do things little by little. Whereas something like this, I'll go with the smaller one, but you want to go bigger, go home. Yeah. I'd rather go broke, but then be sad. So, Tessie and I have no business buying Absolutely Christmas not. trees for our room. <laughs> no business at all. But just look how tempting this is. It's like a winter wonderland here in Target. Like, one thing Target knows how to do is to show up and show up for a holiday, okay? Oh, wow. Look, y'all. Like, are you kidding me? Yes. Like, come on. Okay, y'all. So, remember how I was telling y'all in other videos that, like, my room is super unfinished? Oh, my God. There's music in here. But, okay. So, my room is super, super unfinished. And I finally found the drawer unit that I wanted. Jesse wants to get another cart because... We've got some of this stuff in here and I have like a storage bin down there. So it's a little chaotic, but um, I'm probably gonna like pick and choose. I might not end up getting everything, we'll see. But the important part is we got the drawer unit that I needed. So I think I'm gonna finally fix up my room today. So I'm excited. Okay, she brought the second cart, but my wrist is like messed up. And like I definitely have the strength to do this, but my wrist is so messed up that it's not yeah like so my wrist is messed up like i definitely have the strength to do this but the way my wrist is right now i can't so i'm trying to you know how many you know how many young men i saw in here today where are they Are you able to? <laughs> Wait, you gotta look with your eyes. Excuse me? Yeah. Ten minutes. For real? Yeah. Wow. I was like, there's no way. Hey, Tyler, Tyler. What are you trying to do? I put it in the car. <laughs> 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 I'm 
Hey, what? Why was that so hard? Okay. So, <laughs> someone happened to be walking by and Jesse's like, oh, um, excuse me. <laughs> now we're chill. Now we're to the Christmas section. We're going to put everything. <laughs> <laughs> we're only going to put the ornaments back, but I hope I find them next week. I mean, if I don't. Okay, so let me show y'all what I've got going on here. So, I got a cute little like white tree, right? And then I found these ornaments, like pink and gold, and then the crown to top the tree. So I'm gonna put this back. If I don't find this next week, at the very minimum, I'll have the cute little like crown. And it's very me anyway, I'm very minimal. So. Oh, I'm so excited. So at least I'll have my room like getting in like a good place. Okay, so we're gonna go put this back. My arm, my shoulders really hurt. I pull something. Oh. <laughs> it's called resolve. Okay, y'all. So we about to start my room process. So this is okay. I got um like a bin, and I'm gonna start storing everything. Thank you, man. See what does it say? Carpet cleaner. <laughs> <laughs> the resolve. I'm like, Tessie, bring me the resolve. She's like, the what? I'm like, the resolve. I have soot on my floor, like from my can. I think I told you guys. And she was like, you can't just say the carpet cleaner. Anyways, so I got my tea for my energy. I'm gonna chug it. I'm so thirsty. But I didn't want coffee again. I didn't want like the milk and the heaviness and all that, whatever. So I'm gonna start by. All right. So this is what we're working with here. This corner right here. All right, so it looks crazier from a distance. So I'm gonna show you. Basically, I've got some dirty laundry right here, and this is just pillows and some laundry. My old steering wheel cover that I'm not gonna put on my new car, so I should probably get rid of that. And then all of this stuff. So we've got some old PR stuff I got. This box was a gift, and I haven't gotten rid of it. I don't know why. Then I have actually bins in here that have some products in it so that's gonna just stay in that then i have the ultimate hoarders uh, the apple box and then i have my headphone box my phone box this is my computer at least i still have all these things it's not like stuff i don't have anymore um my acetone so all of this nail stuff is essentially what i really want to put away then i have some old notebooks i have my old apron from when i worked that first watch my yoga mat um so yeah, this is what we've got to consolidate into this bin that I bought here. And guys, this is my favorite part. Look how cute this Christmas tree is! And I got the little crown ornament, so I'm so excited to put that together. I put these shoes away, these are the slippers I'm wearing right now. And um, so yeah, so I just wanna kinda like clean up. So you see how my desk is like the ending point for everything, so I have an empty water bottle per huge. I have my shaker cup here for what reason? My empty water bottle here. This was something I bought. It's empty right now because I want to shout out that brand um, computer. I got a new candle at Target because it was like $12. But look at it, guys. It's so pretty. So I feel like it's going to tie in really, really nicely. Because for my room, my goal is to keep up the like the pinks. And the whites, but I want to tie in cream and gold too, because I I'm, I don't like to choose. I just want to do both. So if I tie them in seamlessly, you won't really know. <laughs> so I got an empty wine glass from last night here. So I'm excited. We're gonna get started. So if I'm trying to film everything, I'm gonna take forever, and I don't want to do that. Oh, and then the drawer unit that I bought. Y'all saw the struggle that we were going through in Target. That junk is still in my car. I'm waiting for my dad to come home. <laughs> So you can get it out unless I find a way to get it in the house myself, but either way I need him to build it for me So I might just wait for him. He's out doing a job. My mom actually went with him because it's for one of my mom's friends So she went there to go hang out with her while he worked on her house and stuff So he'll come home way later. So I might have to wait for tomorrow for that So today I'm basically preparing my room to accept those drawers and to seamlessly Start making everything look good. We're starting in this cool knot. So I got this bin from Target. Not bad. These tar Target has so many bins. This is like a it's pretty deep. Oh, the hair tickled me. It's pretty deep and um it's the one that goes under your bed. 
So I feel like I'd be able to get a lot done with that. Now we're gonna go through, this is garbage. See, I have like little things like this, like my nail stuff, like I said, like you guys know I used to do my own. Well, I do my own nails sometimes lately. I've been lazy, I just rather pay for the convenience at this point. I see, I forgot to buy cotton rounds. So, yes, I keep these, okay? So, I keep the boxes of things because like, I might need something from it. So, these are my Beats headphones box, my iPhone box. Okay, I never need anything. I don't know. I just honestly, I'm not going to even try to pretend to explain myself. So, this is my new stuff. We're going to close this up in here. Y'all, I just got so much stuff, sis. So yeah, these are all things that like I know I don't want to throw away. I just don't necessarily need at hand every single day. So that's what's going under the bed. Okay, hey, Ray. Hold this. Oh, freaking going out of my way to find out the scam likely. I never have my phone on like loud. Um, anyway, so acetone, yeah, like I said, just always good to have these things around. Actually, I don't want to leave that in there because it's a liquid and that might burst and the acetone can cut right through that plastic. And I think this is, yeah, this is from like my batteries. See, like, there's no reason why I have this. So this, Perfume is sitting over there. I've used both of these and I use this on a regular basis. So like, why do I sell the box? Like, why am I like this? That's gonna go over there. So then I have stuff like this, which is already consolidated into a bin. But, so this stuff is gonna be like bath, which what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna like keep it just like this and put it um in the drawers of the dresser like the bottom drawer i'll probably use like for bathroom stuff so have my little do rag situation here my grande hair see this serum is sitting in my bathroom like why do you have it here garbage garbage oh these are my good patches this is gonna stay in there my hair stuff Again, in there. This is for, I think it's for my lamp. It's gonna be there. Yeah, garbage. Oh. Some band aids. I have like this little organizational thing, which I'm not gonna go far, far, because I might use that on my dresser now. Oh my gosh, and I have, oh, okay. this is why I love cleaning stuff out, because I forget what I have, okay? Here's my five love languages book, which I love to have this at hand so like I can just give to people to read because this book, baby, highly recommend that to absolutely everybody. Everyone needs to learn how to love people. All right, this is the bath stuff. I have this hair mask from IGK that they sent me and I totally forgot about it. Yum, love that for my hair. And this is my Urban Decay Vice Liquid Lip. Listen. This is one of the best liquid lipsticks I've ever tried. I went to Ulta the other day and you finally have it in Ulta. If you haven't tried it yet, try it. I promise you. So the claims are like it's PDA proof and all that stuff. Baby, it won't go anywhere. My tanning mint, my tanning mousse, whatever I'll call it. I have my bonding oil. I'll put all my hair stuff here too. Oh, see, I have a body scrub here that I still haven't used. Look at that. Um, mm, it's so good. This is empty. What was in here? It's like a ring box. I don't know. It's for the nails. This is a shine spray. This glue gel. Okay, so this gel by Aunt Jackie's. Auntie knew what she was doing because this gel really works. But baby, she flakes so easily. No, thank you. So then I got this is an 
Aveda cleansing bars. I'll put that in the bath thing too. This is garbage. I have some thread here from when I was threading lips and brows and stuff. Okay. So that's that. Now this is finally empty. I'm probably, I have to clean this out first. But I'm probably gonna put right all that right back in here and just leave this to be like the bath and body thing. So literally these are empty. Not fully empty, but they're pretty empty shampoo bottles. Actually, there's still enough in here. I'm not throwing that away. This is like the best shampoo. And why do I have it in here? I have no idea because it's in here and I forgot I had it and that's why I haven't used it. I'm gleaming. Look at this. Why do I still have this packaging? Why am I like this? Okay, so this part is done. Let me show you guys. We've cleared up all that. This is all like the skincare that I apparently had. I didn't know I have an entire hydrating mask from Aveda. I love that stuff. When I was in school, I used to do it to myself every single day. I'm out of breath. I was running around and lifting stuff. Whoops. So these two bins are the bins that I had in that corner like I showed you guys. And look, I emptied them out completely. I didn't need any of it. Excuse me. Some of that was in it. And then in this bin, this is the one that's going under my bed. See, I thought it was going to be a lot more stuff in here. So all I have in here are like the nail stuff. I have my book. An extra notebook that I might double into soon. Um, some cords. And just my boxes. So that part is done. So that part of my room is complete. And... I might as well use these box, these bins for leverage. Actually, whatever. Okay. So this part of my room is done, and I'm gonna lock this up and slide it under my bed. And this is officially out of the way. And then now I have these two bins available for I'm not sure what yet. And then I had bought this. This is one of those like you can buy these little things in Target, like little organizational things. There's like two, three dollars, maybe less. So I'm not going to put that too far because I might use this as like a um, jewelry dish in the meantime. But this guy, I'm just going to roll her under. Period. For now. And then I also found my mirror from when I was in school. So I'm going to keep her close too. And what else? Now my subwoofer needs to be rehomed to somewhere else because I have a subwoofer right here and this guy goes obviously with my sound bar which is still not mount mounted on my wall. It's there, standing there, super ghetto but whatever, very bootleg <laughs> and um, eventually I'm going to get my dad to do that for me. There goes Tessie sending me YouTube, my TikTok videos. And um, what else? So this part's done. I think I'm going to tap into over there. We're going to do that. My little Christmas tree is going to go up later when I do my actual dresser. I am praying with everything in me. My dad has the energy to put it up for me today because of my instant gratification needs. But if not, it's going to go up tomorrow and that's totally fine. And it won't take him long because my sister has the same exact dresser and here he assembled hers and he did it really quickly so i'm not trying to be no body builder this time no ma'am i assembled my own desk my dad still had to come up behind me and fix some things so no oh shiny okay y'all so we're about to head out again because Sessie forgot to buy something but look how nice so far how i love my dog's toys are everywhere it's like i have a child let's see so now this is where the dresser is going to go. So this is just temporary. I'm probably gonna slip that under the bed too. This is just the cable to my ring light. I'm just being lazy, I'm not putting it away right now. That's another tripod I have. I have a tripod over there. My desk, I somewhat cleaned it off a little bit. Everything that I had under here for absolutely no reason. Um, I slipped it under into the bin that's under there. And yeah, so that is that for now. Then I still have that shelf that's there. I might go through that and stick some of that in the underbed bin as well. And I want to organize that. I want to get all of this off the ledge. I totally forgot about that. So I'm probably gonna do that. And I think I'm gonna buy a floating shelf so I can put my perfumes up there. Because my room is still giving very much empty and undone. So 
that's what's going on right now i do want to put a mirror in here but it's just not really practical unless i were to hang it or something but i want like a standing mirror but the dress is gonna go there my little christmas tree i'm gonna set that up when we get back and that's gonna go on top of the dresser more than likely so yeah we're gonna head out now to go get something else tessie is missing uh, the sun should be setting soon but it's okay what the <laughs> what it was like a mom and her kid with their big dog and like Michaels and oh, there we go. it's too dark. We're in Michaels and the Christmas I went to Michaels is just so freaking cute. Are you kidding me? Like Michaels is just one of those stores that like give you a little serotonin boost, especially during the holidays, you know? Because they just go so hard for holidays. Is there many? I like that. It's cute. Focus, come to me. Santa Entertainment Food Truck Vendors, Tree Lighting, and more. What's up, y'all? Hello, happy Sunday. It's the next day. So, this morning we all went to church um, to see got baptized today. And then we went, we went to get food. And now I just made some hot chocolate. Well, Tessie and I made hot chocolate. She made her own, but. Made some chocolate, look how cute. I am waiting for my dad to come back from Home Depot. So hopefully, hopefully, hopefully he'll put my um my little unit together. And um I feel like there was something else I wanted to tell you. I forgot. It's Sunday, and like I said, so hopefully my dad's gonna do that for me today. Oh shoot, I gotta finish laundry. So I'm gonna finish the laundry and hopefully my dad will do that, and then I'll show you guys what the room looks like. Um, not really doing anything was fun today. Like, oh, I lied. We're putting up the Christmas tree today. I might show you guys that. Let's just see how this day goes. Oh, it's just little guy. Oh, my sweet boy. Hi. What about my next one? Oh, hi, mommy. Oh, she's so cute. I love how she does that. Mama's camera that you're always sitting on. Yes. <laughs> but guys, I don't really know when my parents are going to be home And I really want to wrap up this vlog so I can get this posted But, so anyways, I will start a new vlog And I'll show you guys Christmas tree in that one Thank you so much for watching another one of my videos And I'll see you guys in the next one Say bye Say bye Oh, oh it's his birthday today <laughs>